This is a standard way of doing a rollover test. A car is mounted sideways on a sled and accelerated down a track, in this case at a speed of 47 km per hour or 29 miles per hour. An obstacle is placed in its way and when it hits that, the car starts to roll. Take a look at the two videos. The main one shows a child dummy in a shield seat and the small inset video shows a child dummy in a five-point harness seat. Concentrating on the large video of the shield seat, you can see how as the car hits the ground for the first time, the child is already loosened in the seat and starts to slide up with nothing holding them in. Now the car makes another roll and again hits the side and you can see what happens to the child. The child is ejected from the seat, which would most likely already have resulted in cranial and spinal trauma, potentially life-changing injuries. But the car carries on. A third time, the car hits the side, and now the child is thrown fully from the seat. At this point, there is a high probability that the injuries sustained are likely to be lethal trauma.